This is Twit. Uh, the phones are open, 888-827-5536. If you call, you know who's going to answer. This lovely woman here, Kim Schaffer. Hello, Kim. Good morning. Good morning. I'm sorry, I started such a somber note. Let's cheer up. Well, I'm going to go with the call that made me laugh the most. That sounds good. Thank you, Kim. <laughs> Dina in Bless Manhattan you. Beach wants a uh, app where she can track her husband from her iPhone to his Samsung phone. But he knows about it, so I guess it's not... Hey, that's but, fair. But uh, <laughs> if you don't know the answer, a friend of mine is doing this with her daughter, so... Yeah, I, I, there's uh, lots of ways. There's probably lots yeah. of ways, so I have the name of one app. What's that? Uh, Life360, I heard. Oh, yeah, I've heard of yeah. that, yeah. And she's got a Samsung, her daughter's got an iPhone. That's, and... a, that's a good one, yeah. Thank you, Kim. Right. Let's say hi to uh, to Dina in Manhattan Beach. Hi, Dina. Leo Laporte, the tech guy. Hi, oh, how are you? I'm wonderful. So you want to track your husband, huh? Yeah, I tracked my son and my dog, so I wanted to track my <laughs> So uh, if you think about it, a smartphone is is basically made to be a tracker. Because what do we have in here? We have an always-on Internet connection. We have a GPS radio, which will tell you uh, where the phone is within three meters. Uh -huh. I mean, this thing is it, – it, not only that, I mean, it's got a camera, microphone, and speaker. I mean, this thing is the ultimate spy device. So, of yeah. course, you should have the permission of the person you're following. And if you do have their permission, it's a lot easier to keep track of them. Oh, you may not get have permission. I still would do it. Yeah, yeah. So there's software uh, on there. Obviously, you're familiar. Uh, it sounds like you might do this even with your kids with uh, uh, Find My Friends on the iPhone. And, uh, yeah, I have Find My Friend and I have 360 on my son's iPhone. Okay. So those so are. I don't have it on my husband's phone because he, I couldn't get it. To, I, find my friends only for Apple so yeah. I wanted to I wanted to do something else so we can we can all know where my son is basically so we can both track our son I do really like uh, I really like this idea you I don't know if you read the Harry Potter books but in one of the one of the books there's a family that has a clock but instead of showing the time it shows the location of every member of the family and when dad comes home from work, the, the big hand goes from work to home and things like that. It's just a really cool idea. And, and absolutely, there are ways to do this. Uh, Google Maps, for instance, will let you share your location. Um, that, and everybody has Google Maps. So this works cross, completely cross-platform. But it does require the cooperation of the person you're tracking. So they can open okay. the Google Map, tap the blue dot, that shows where you are, and then uh, the menu that pops up, one of the items in the menu will be share location, and you can say share this with mom and how long. I, You know, it does time out after a while. Uh, but you can't, but you can, if you wish, say until uh, you, I turn it off. And, okay. and then that will be kind of permanent sharing. And then what you'll have is kind of like that clock. By the way, this is free, and it, again, completely cross-platform. It'll work on any device, including a tablet. Um, as long as it has GPS in it or some sort of form of location finding. And and then what you'll get is like that Harry Potter clock, your Google map from now on will have an icon showing you uh, where people are. So I think that's that's a really uh, cool idea. It's like, uh, like actually more like maybe the if we're going to stick with the Harry Potter thing. Remember that map that they found that showed everybody's location in Hogwarts, the Marauders map? It's kind of more like like that so uh to my understanding that can be left on permanently although again my suspicion is it will time out so your husband or your son will have to turn that on uh from time to time uh i'm sure there are other uh life is life 360 only on the iphone that would be kind of uh that's the that's the same idea um let me just check here. The idea is that you can, it does crash detection, emergency response, but it also lets you know where everybody is. No, iPhone and Android. So it is on Android as well. So that would be even kind of maybe a better idea because uh, it's really designed to do exactly what you want to do, keep track of everybody in the family. The app is free. I would not be surprised if there is some uh, in-app purchase at some point. But it, uh, it will show you, uh, it gives you alerts when members of your family circle uh, get to the school or get to work, you know. Joey arrived at school. Joey arrived at work. 
Uh, it'll have distracted driving details. So if you have teenagers who are driving, that's really great. This seems like ex this is thank you, Kim. This seems like exactly the program for this. Um, invite only. Only circle members can see each other's members and locations, and that's that's important because uh, after all, uh, you know, this could be invasive if you don't have permission. I mean, maybe free, free. I don't uh, now that if it is free, then that makes me nervous because that means they're using, you know, nothing's free, free. If you don't pay money for it, then there's some way that they're unless they're, you know, great benefactors of humanity. There's some way they're making money on this. It costs money to do something like this. They may be collecting information about your location and selling it, that kind of thing. I'll look into this in, in more detail. In fact, I think I'll install it. This is a great idea. It it also for 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 new drivers. It's life360.com. Ah, it does have some paid option. Thank you Evil Bob in the chat room. He says it's not free free. There's some paid options. You know what? That makes me feel better. I want it to be paid a little bit. That's that's better. Leo Laporte the tech guy.